Hi everyone, so today I'm going to do a quick video on my empties and I will link my last empties video down below and my voice might sound a little bit off because I have a cold but I'm getting over it. So um, my empties videos are just like short reviews on products that I've used completely up. So uh, yeah, oh I hope y'all like my new background. And I will link my room tour video down below. Um, I filmed that, like, last week. So, yeah. But it's, like, a scheduled... No, wait. I filmed it, like, a week before I put it up, basically. Almost a week. So, anyways, this is my empties at the moment. They're very, very full. And so, I'm going to do the first one, the biggest one. This is the Tresemme um hairspray and this is chest two spray this is the four like extra hold this is my this is like my personal favorite hairspray that i've ever tried um just i don't know i just feel like it's a good flexible hold but you like lightly spray it you know there's nothing coming out but um oh always when you're spraying your hair here's a quick tip um, I've heard from, I've heard from, like, a person that does hair to, like, put your, like, hairspray can all the way out and spray and don't be, like, spraying like this because, you know, that's, that's probably a lighter mist from back here and you don't get a big old wet spot on your head because I've, well, especially when I was little, like, I would have crunchy hair sometimes, so... The next thing is a Crest um, baking soda and peroxide whitening toothpaste in Fresh Mint. And this was pretty good. I had like two of these in my last one. My mom was giving me some toothpaste today. This is the White Citrus uh, White Citrus Shea Enriched Shower Gel. And this is from Bath & Body Works. And I like their shower gels, but they're really expensive. They're like... This is the old packaging, and this is, like, was $11. I think they're $12 now. And I think I got this on sale, but I think it's pretty expensive, so I don't think I would really want to repurchase a body wash from here unless it was on sale or it was, like, my favorite scent. And my favorite scent is Moonlight Path from Bath & Body Works. So let's keep moving on. This is from Bath & Body Works, and my friend gave this to me for... My last birthday, I think, yeah. I use it all the way up. This is the Velvet Sugar, and it has, like, the tiniest bit left. I probably, if I, like, sprayed it. No, it's not coming out. Oh, there went the lid. <laughs> this smelled really good. It's a really sweet smell, and I liked it, and I used it up. It was a great size for my purse, so I enjoyed that. This is just some tissues that I used up. And these are like, I think the same one as last time maybe. These have like the heels and the purse on them. These are puffs. They were good. I decided to throw that in there. Um, this is my what my mom used up. Sometimes I use um, powder on my face, but I like to set my concealer. But sometimes I just don't worry with it because I have dry skin and it might just make it look worse and less. Sometimes I set it, but you know, if you have dry skin, it's not completely necessary to use a powder. I mean, unless you just want to set your makeup, you could use a setting spray. So this is from Clinique, and this is in number 8, Transparency Neutral. So it's basically transparent, but it's not like the white, because if you get a white, um, translucent, that's what I'm trying to say, a white translucent powder, this says transparency. Anyways, um, if you get a white, translucent yeah translucent powder um if you take pictures like flash photography um and you're wearing that powder it can give a white cast on your face so it's really not good for like weddings graduations or wherever you're taking pictures because it can leave a white cast on your face and you'll look at your picture and it'll be really weird looking so this next product is out the door um, top coat for nails and let's see I have at the moment I have no nail polish on so sorry because they might look a little bit nasty 
Um, it just got gloopy and my acetone is like has a brush melted in it and I didn't want to put the acetone in here to make it thinner and I don't have nail polish in there so I was just going to get rid of it because it and I'm not like the biggest fan of this actually um, because it is a fast drying top coat it can kind of shrink up around your nails and look weird make your nail polish look weird so not the biggest fan of this. Um, I don't know if I'd repurchase it. At the moment, I just have a really cheap one. It is, uh, the NYC. It was like 98 cents. Just a top coat, and it's like a big bottle, so. This next thing, I'll do this first. This is from Clinique, and I use it, it was a sample. I used it all the way up, and I actually, at first was like, uh, I don't really like it, but, actually, there's a little bit left, but. Anyways, I, the more and more I use it, the more I liked it because I can mix it with brighter lipsticks and make it darker. And what is on my lips would be down below. And the concealer I'm wearing is the Neutrogena, it's one for eyes or whatever. Um, and these earrings, I'll just list it down below. So anyways, this is their chubby stick in number one. So it's like a neutral color, kind of like the brownish pinkish color that's kind of in at the moment. Um, I liked it. It was, I used it all the way up, like that's all the way up and it was a kind of good sample size. So I like this, but they make so many chubby sticks at the drugstore. That's cheaper. So I probably wouldn't buy that. Um, this is from Mary Kay, the Satin Hands Pe Peach Hand Cream. And this is really good. This is like my favorite hand cream. Um, and I use it all the way up. It's completely empty. Um, I, probably if I cut this top part off. Have you ever cut the top part off of like a lotion or something? And squeezed it out and you get a lot more product? I could do that, but I'm not going to do that. So, I really like this. And I think this, like, the Satin Hands kit is like $30 or something, I think. It's just a really good kit. It'd be like a really, really good gift for someone. I really liked it. And for like at home manicures, it's nice. This peach hand cream soaks in so quick. I really, really like it. So that is it for my empties video. And yes, I hope that y'all enjoyed this. Go follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Pinterest. And go read the description down below. I always, I'm trying to like write more things in there, link things in there. Um, so yeah, I hope that y'all are having a fabulous day. Bye.